All right, where's the fire? We're gonna make a little horse-drawn fire wagon. What everything starts with is a bunch of popsicle sticks and we're going to cut it to all our appropriate pieces. We cut a couple holes because that's going to be where our wheels go for the axle and then a bunch of bigger pieces and a bunch of little pieces. I'll show you how and of course the bottle caps. One more thing, you'll need a dowel, a skinny one. I used a uh, bamboo little skewer for shish kebabs. All right, now we're gonna start gluing them together. We're gonna kinda glue it together like we did for the farmer's market little fruit crates, but we're gonna do an extra piece, the ones with the holes, cause we have to have a place for where the axle of the wheels go. You'll notice that I have the parts with the holes. They will hang down low there because that's where our wheels are gonna go through. Once we have it all dry, we'll do a, a quick little stain over all of it and uh, give it kind of a good uh, wood look. that part's dry you have to do the red because it's not a fire truck without red on it and I just did the top the bottom part I'll leave wood that'll be kind of like the um, and I use some of my bronzy paint to paint the words fire department it looks goofy now but uh, later on I go over it with a black sharpie paint pen to define the words. And there you go. Now you can see what it says. Time to tackle the wheels. The first thing I did was just paint them all black. Once the base coat dries, now we're gonna paint the, the rims and the spokes. So I stole, I mean, I borrowed some of these little twist ties that you get at the produce section of the grocery store and they were black. So they were perfect for this. 
and I thought I would uh, put this all the way around the red ridge of the uh, bottle caps to cover up the the spiky part so it looks a little more tire like And now I have these little washers that I'm going to stick in the middle just to build up the illusion of a, a wheel. Alright, I found this old highlighter pen and the cap was a perfect shape for a water tank. And uh, we're doing an old fashioned horse drawn wagon fire truck as, and you have to have a place to put all the water. So I went ahead and painted this. Now because it's plastic, you probably, if you've ever painted on plastic, you know it takes a lot of coats because it just wants to fall off. So your first coat is just going to be kind of a really thin base coat so that all the other coats have something to cling on to. So you just layer, 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 layer. And then I just cut a circle of cardboard the same size as the very top to cover the top because uh, we have to build up the illusion this is a big old water tank and then I'm gonna place a bead on top of that and a little sequin on top of that once it's all painted it'll look very uniform Now we're going to take the bronze paint and start to unify this object, all these different separate objects, into one water tank. And ta-da, it was like this pen cap was made to be a fire truck water tank. All right, you can't have a fire truck without a ladder or two. I just took a bunch of toothpicks and I cut them into little pieces and using just a wire cutter, snipped them right into pieces and um, glued them all together.
And now we're going to stick the wheels on. It's pretty straightforward. Stick the dowel through the holes it, if you have them all lined up. Now when I drilled this, I drilled them all together as one piece, the wood pieces, so that they would line up on both sides. And then the, the wheels, they're just right in the middle. So once I stuck them all on there, I kept the dowel long on purpose just so that I can stick it on there and it's easier to manipulate. And then later on, I glue it and uh, snip them to size. I made another little box. It's just basically a tiny little fruit crate box made out of the popsicle sticks. And this is gonna be where the driver sits and whatever materials they need to store away in this box. So I built the box and then I put a back to the seat and a little footrest. Starting to take shape. I painted that box on top red and, um, and I'm going to paint the ladders the same bronzy color as the top of the water tank and then I'll paint the seat black just to define the section. We got to glue the little ladders on. I wanted to put something on the back of that seat area there on top of the little box on top. Um, so I decided to make a hose and I just found some black wire that was about the right width and wound it up around my paintbrush here and dipped the end in silver paint to make it kind of a fake nozzle and stuck it on the back. got a cute little uh, fire wagon. I wanted to make little horses. Maybe I'll do that later. Make a make it out of clay or something or find little bitty horses to put with it. And it was really fun to make and I completely had to use my brain on this little engineering feat. <laughs> I hope you liked it. If you liked it, definitely give me a like. I appreciate it a lot. And if you really like me, a subscribe would be awesome. Thank you so much for those that have already and you have a great day. Bye-bye.